What's up, guys? Welcome back to episode 24 of our Pokemon Violet series. Last time, we managed to evolve Clarence, which is awesome. Um, and then we kind of just, like, spent the entire time dicking around looking for the fucking Titan Pokemon here. Only to find out that I think I literally just need to talk to one of these guys. And it might happen. I don't fucking know. Or I just kill as many of these as I can until something happens. Bullet seed. Come on, Doc. Let's just... Let's just get to it. <laughs> I hope. I could be completely wrong here. I don't know. But I do remember that we caught this guy. And it did say that they like... Um, they somehow have some weird thing with like... Wait, does someone meant to just kill it? Am I crazy? Yeah, it just kills itself. I thought I remember like reading something when we like first caught them. That they like all like to bundle together. Do I have to fight, like, a certain one? There's one here. This guy's, like, in the water. Maybe this one's different? I don't know. I think that we just kind of murder as many of these as we can until something happens. <laughs> and we'll just keep doing it. I didn't really read that much. I just saw in the guide that it was just like, oh, like, go to this island, and then you see these fish, and you interact with them. I'm like, okay, I get it. Apparently, I don't. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Also, Doc is not doing nearly enough damage with his fucking, uh, with his bullet seed. It's a little disappointing. But also, aren't these guys, like, a little overleveled for us? We might, we might also just get dicked in this fight. I don't know. Okay, mister. Another bullet seed coming your way. No, they're only 45. I guess they're just not a water type. I forget what type they are, then. Yes, bye-bye. If it hits five times, we're golden. But so far, all these guys have done is just done moment Memento and kill themselves. Which I think is so funny. Like, because theoretically, Doc, if this didn't reset every time, Doc would just be, like, so weak right now. But they, they, all their efforts are for naught. Um... I don't know, are you weird? I don't think we've killed this colored one yet. I don't fucking know, dude. There's something sparkling over there. There's no way that's it, right? No, but that's like a raid. I'm so confused. I don't I don't get what we're missing. I thought I honestly spoiled it for myself, but I guess I just am an idiot and am not getting it. Okay, are you gonna memento also? No, we nasty plotted. Okay, someone's a little different. Someone's a little quirky. This is bold seat again. God, I will, maybe we should like see what fucking uh, thing this guy is so that we, what typing it is so we can actually like maybe put out a super effective Pokemon. Okay, I have all these Tatsugiri scales. Do I have to maybe collect enough Tatsugiri scales and then be able to use it? Does this guy look different than the other ones? This guy looks a little chunkier. Okay, well, that literally said Titan, no? Holy shit. See, yeah, look, the, okay, so that was the Pokemon that I was talking about, where if you have them, those two out at the same time, they become just, like, a different Pokemon, which is kind of crazy. Uh, is Don Dozo a uh, grass type, or, like, or a water type? Fuck, dude. I kind of want to ult now, because then we get... Arvin coming with us normally, right? When it, on the second try. I do love that we have the fucking <laughs> the stupid thing just right in front of us. The, the raid thing, just like distorting our view. It's so funny. Yes, you look beautiful. There you go. Let's see if Bolt Seed murders him. Okay, that is super effective. So two does a, like a quarter of itself, which is good. Okay. Super effective. Hit four times. So if we are able to get another one off without getting O code, might be good. Come on, Bold Seed, don't fail us now. It doesn't really say what level the Titan is ever, right? It just it just gives us its health bar, so we really have no way of knowing how strong we need to be. We've we haven't really ever gone fucked up by it. 
uh, by a, a Titan yet. Or, like, lost to one, I don't think, right? I could be wrong. It's so hard to remember these things. Okay, well, phase one complete, I think. So what, do I just have to follow where the little fucker goes? Because that guy just fucks off. He's just like, I don't want to deal with this anymore. Okay, find the false... Well, I see it there. Uh, can I just heal up Doc real quick? There you go. Well, I, I literally... That's the one that we were fighting. So do I just have to run into him again? Oh, get back over here, bitch. I see you. I fucking see you. Come here. Or do I just have to punch his friend again? Okay, I just have to punch his friend again. Or chomp. I don't understand what the relationship is here. Oh my god. I thought he just murdered his friend, but he hit the... <laughs> he just hit the cave open. <laughs> I was like, oh, are you gonna, like, eat your little guy? So it's that guy is the ma that guy is the power behind holy shit Arvin game fucking stashing in holy crap what's right did you find the tie it's right here did you not see this giant fucking whales hit it sure it's one big uh dragon wait is it even a dragon or is it a fish I don't know I don't think I've caught this thing yet huh well yeah it's this tiny guy and then he just eats him it's so weird. The, the little sushi guy got eaten up by the Titan. Yeah, I don't understand this uh, relationship, but I guess it worked out for them. Yeesh, didn't expect to see the food chain in action today. I, so the guy went got powered up and then got eaten by the bigger guy. So I don't understand how the biology works on that, for one, but... I don't know. I don't think Pokemon's ever been one for biology. Um, I mean, I guess we, we just bullet seed again, right? Like, we got no reason not to. It's funny that we get to, like, do Trash Slice again. Because the whole thing with Trash Slice is we have, we have to, like, go back to the... We can only use it once per, like, rest. But I guess because it's a, a, a Titan, they're like, Ah, you know, use it as many times as you need, Chief. Don't worry about it. We got you handled on fucking Trash Slices. Bullet Seed. Hopefully just murders him. I, I mean, it's probably not. It, yeah, it's probably going to do less damage. So it might, it might take two turns this time to kill him. Or three turns, I don't know. Depending how many times I, uh, I decide to hit, or Doc decides to hit. Okay, Water Pearl surely is fine. Oh yeah, I mean, he hits Greedent too, so we're totally Gucci on that front. Okay. Uh, so I'm just gonna be spamming A until we fucking kill this guy. It's a pretty boring battle, all things considered. When I was reading the guide thing to like figure out how to get get this going it was like oh like this is considered one of the hardest things in the entire game you might want to fin consider completing literally everything else so i'm like i got a little scared i was like oh maybe i will just get whomped but no we're just fucking murking him so easily also doc did you just only hit two fucking times you son of a bitch you goddamn son of a bitch mama didn't raise no bitch okay you gotta finish him off at least hit three times if i gotta hit bullet seat again i'll be i'll be mad I'll be mad, Doc, okay? That's about it. I'm not benching you, because God, do I not want to train up another Pokemon. That'll be too annoying. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Fucking nailed that shit. Yeah, go back to bed. So, this was like the last time Pokemon, right? Uh, is your guy going to be, like, fully done, Arvin? Like, is your, guy, is your uh, boss Sif going to be fully good? Now that the Titan's taken care of, next up on the menu is that Herba Mystica. Yes, let's just, uh, can we hurry up? Mm-hmm. Well, the little sushi guy escaped without becoming that little thing's lunch. Uh, okay. <laughs> He's just going Mobus mode. Something about that tiny little Pokemon just getting fucking, uh, <laughs> ultra powered up. Like, that is just so funny to me. Uh, let's just do Phantom Force for the fuck of it. I think this is a dragon type, right? So maybe we at, we wait till um, Doc dies and then oh shit! I was like, wait, does that hit us in in the fucking Phantom Zone? But no, I, but yeah, I'll probably wait and see if Clarence dies, and then we'll, and then we'll go from there, I guess. Oh, and use oh he taunted him. Okay, we're fine. 
I kind of just like I don't want to switch out. It'd just be too much effort. God damn. But now that I think about it, Fan Force takes two turns to do 90 damage, and this at least does in two turns at least does 100 damage. So Bolt is just actually more effective. I'm I'm so stupid. Yes, get out of here. Okay, okay. We got three hits. I guess that's fine. Okay. So I guess it's, it's just a dragon type. What the fuck? I don't understand how exactly this Pokemon gets powered up when it gets eaten by the other guy. Or, like, how that relationship... Oh, fuck. Uh, like, I don't understand stat-wise how that works. But, uh... I don't know. Maybe one day I'll go look up and see what it looks like. Because, like, it seems like it's only, like, a competitive thing. Because, like... Like, you can't do double battle. Like, like you know, the fucking... Uh, the Pokemon League's not going to be double battles, right? It, not, it hardly ever is, I don't think. Okay, Bullet Seed. Please don't miss. Okay, we should be all done. I guess I can see how this would be hard if you have to do, like, these two strong Pokemon back-to-back, -back, but... Kind of bitch-made. It's kind of bitch-made, not going to lie. Yes, we did. We murked that guy. I kind of like how Doc's eyes are two, are completely different, or like uh, inverted of each other. It looks kind of cool. Okay, what now, Arvin? Can you go heal up your guy? I, I just want to see him be happy. I just want to see Mabasif be happy. Phew, nice job, Blizzard. But that's my hard-working little bud. Maybe the little tight maybe the Titan was both those Pokemon together? Like some kind of combo meal? Yeah, I don't dude, I don't know. I don't I don't go to school. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I don't understand Pokemon. I just know I'm good at it. <laughs> the little one came out of here, which means there should be some Herba Miska inside. Let's go, Wiz Ride. Yes. Please. I am curious to see what other because th the only other thing that we've like eight like HM wise that we don't really have. There was dive. Don't think we're gonna need dive. There was like rock climb. Don't think we'll need rock climb. I mean, rock climb would actually be useful. Um, or waterfall. Other than that, I can't think of any other things that we'd be missing. Right? Rock smash, strength. But I, I, we haven't like seen any strength type rock things. The last Herba Mystica. Yes, buddy. I am kind of. This is, like, the first storyline that we're completing, so it'll be interesting to see what happens. Okay, let's see what the book has to say. So it seems the spicy Urban Mystica is supposed to boost your metabolism. It gives your circulation a boost and helps flush out all these, all of those toxins, along with a ton of sweat. Okay. You know what's next? Chow time. I don't know if that's what he said. I just didn't read <laughs> after the dot, dot, dot. Yeah, I'm not. What the, what the fuck? What are those sounds, my man? Here And here we go. Trust you, Arvin's cock. Okay. My, uh... <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Chocolate block. Full of, full of cheer. Final herb. Super sandwich. Squeeze this badge tight and cry beautiful tears of friendship as you eat, okay? I'm not gonna fucking cry, my guy. I mean, we're, like, friends, but we're not, like, that good of friends. We didn't, like, suffer that much. I know you're, like, on a whole journey right now, but I'm, like... I, you are just a footnote in my journey, Arvin. Yes, yes, I know you're gonna want to eat it. Here you go. Here you go, become your final Goku form. It's weird. I don't think they've really, like, explained Maridon enough. It's like some weird, crazy Pokemon that just can keep evolving powers based on the sandwiches you fucking get it. I don't know. <laughs> it's weird. Okay, so it is just Rock Climb. That is great. That is actually great. I guess it's Mibasif's turn then. Yes. Come back to full strength, my boy. Oh, God, he looks so beautiful. Look at that big fluffy boy. Come on. Yes, please eat. It would be so sad if he just, like, keels over right now. And we're like, we were so close to the One Piece, man. <laughs> it's going to make you all better, I promise. Wizrad and I, we really did our best to get this for you. We're gonna play with your favorite ball as much as you want. You know, just like we used to. So I guess, like, Arvin's kind of 
you know, his whole road's done, right? After this, he's like, my whole existence, reason for existence, is kind of like done. I've done all that I can. Okay, come on, Mavastiv. Let's see this. I, I get it. It's sad. I, I, I kind of want to keep moving forward, guys. Hello? <laughs> Game, please don't crash. Okay, this is a long black screen, and it's scaring me. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> don't scare me like that, dude. I guess I was just preparing whatever this is. Dude, is he dying? No shot! No way! No! Dude. Oh, dude, I'm so close to crying right now. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Oh my god. There what? is justice in this world. I thought they were gonna kill him. I'm like, dude, kids can't handle this. I can't handle this. Oh. Oh my god. Thank fuck. Dude, Maridon's not even close to that. We're not... We're not even close to that level of emotional, like, <laughs> tightness right there, dude. Holy fuck. Oh. oh, thank God everything's okay. Oh, my God. Jesus, I thought they legitimately just iced him. I thought he died. <laughs> that looks so sad. I thought he was going to, like, walk up and just die in front of the ball. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, yeah, what do you want? Hello, Wizrad. Dude, you're in the middle of such an... Terrible timing, my guy. What? Agya? Seems that Maridon has regained all of his powers, except for the power to battle. Should now be able to climb up any vertical surface it grabs onto while you're riding upon it. If you press the beat button to jump while facing the wall, Maridon will grab onto it, allowing you to climb up vertical surfaces. You can move in any direction, like climbing, like you like, while climbing by using the left stick. Okay, so we just have to make sure we hit B. I can't wait for the mount sense. I'm gonna hang glide instead of fucking grabbing this <laughs> the ledge. And you were your, you were the right one to entrust it to, Wizrad. Ah, listen to you like you had anything to do with it. Bad voice, Arvin. Are you there? Yes, I am. Or he is, I guess. Uh, I've been searching for so long for a way to reach you because so no one else can get me get, get, can get into my lab but you. Excuse me? Yeah, what the fuck is going on? Please take Wizard back to the lighthouse with you. The lab on Poco Path. I will reach out once more when you arrive there. Okay. Is that like all the fuck the way at the beginning of the journey? Woof. Is Arvin the one that gave us <laughs> Maridon? I don't remember. It was so long ago. Okay, so are we like heading back? Or is Mabasif like healed? Or what's going on? Oh, uh, that's that's my dad. Wait, that's his dad? Well, he's buried under his work, off pursuing his own research, never at home with me. It's the first time I've ever heard his voice in years, you know? <laughs> that's so fucked up. And now what? First thing I get is to be treated like some kind of errand boy? Yeah, that's pretty fun. Arvin's had a tough time. He's seriously unbelievable. But I'm guessing you and Maridon probably want to go, huh? Not gonna lie, I feel like my blood's boiling, but sure, fine, I'll get you into the lab. What else can I do? <laughs> oh my god. Arvin's been through it, dude. Lab is off Poco Path at the lighthouse where you and me first met. Okay, yes, it was. It is what I'm thinking about. Come on, let's get moving before I change my mind. Okay. Aw, oh, dude, it's good to see that he he's still in good form. Fuck, dude, that, that almost broke me. If Mabasov actually did die, I would have cried so hard. Dad, where have you been all this time? You little rascal. <laughs> where have you been? Yes, uh, Arvin <laughs> has stuck with a dying dog. The research of fucking, uh, what's it called? Maridon. <laughs> and then also his, his fucking dog's dying. <laughs> and his dad's just never around. It just seems all around a terrible time. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, I guess we're going to go here. I'm kind of just more intrigued. I feel like if we try to do anything else, we just, like, won't finish the episode at time, so. 
This just seems like the right thing to do. Jesus, I feel like it's been so fucking long since... It's literally been since episode one that we've been here, right? Okay, well, up we go. I do know that there is... I did see that there's DLC for this game. Dude, I'm not... I don't have that much money. I don't think I'm gonna fucking buy DLC for this game. <laughs> yeah, it looks stupid. Okay, I'm here. Do I have to, like, go like this? Hello? Am I crazy? I'm saying not supposed to go up here? Uh... I just jump off? Uh... Oh, hello. Eerie impulse. Okay, so where the f oh, oh, fuck me. <laughs> where are we going? Also, wait, let's try this climb thing. Oh god, that is not what I pictured. <laughs> I did not even picture that we'd be doing like Assassin's Creed bullshit. Uh oh, it's probably in this little door. I can't even see that. I think he says H Christ. Alright, Arvin. What's going on? Yes, I did. because uh, I can fly. I'm assuming we took the same service. We could have just like Ubered together. Well, this is live. I used to come here and to play all the time when I was a kid. So where is the professor then? I don't get it. There better be a good reason for calling us here like this. Let's find out. Yeah, I uh, do. I am. I legitimately can't imagine what else they have to do other than just making us like uh, powering up Maridon even more. Everyone always says he's some kind of genius, absolutely brilliant as a Pokemon professor. My dad, that is. But let me tell you, as a parent, he's the worst. Yeah, fucking sounds like it, dude. <laughs> uh. Ugh, it's rough. I mean, I'm more inclined to hang out with you now that I feel bad. <laughs> All he ever does is work. He never comes home. I don't have a single memory of him ever ever even playing with me. His own kind. Um, boss is the only one who is there for me, always. Yeah, that makes even more sense. It makes it even more sad that my boss was basically dying. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Anyways, it's open. Go on in. So are you just gonna dip? I mean, I guess fair enough. You probably don't want to talk to him. Yes, I get it. Yeah, I get it. This is traumatic. You do you, Arvin. You don't have to do anything you don't want to do, my guy. Even though you're... <laughs> we did kind of just insist on going here. <laughs> is this just like an abandoned place? I thought we were in a freezer for a second. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Yeah, this place doesn't look super great. I don't... What is that, like, three printer? What the fuck is this place? Hello? This is weird as shit. <laughs> I need your help. <laughs> it is weird to see Pokemon doing fucking cutscenes like this. It is not great. <laughs> it is good that they're trying, but they've got a long ways to go, man. <laughs> I'm currently at the deepest point of Area Zero in the Great Crater of Paldea. Oh, shit. Yeah, I forgot that that was the whole thing. It's got, like, a crazy suit on, too. I have been researching the unique Pokemon here for a very long time. I'm asking the two of you to lend a hand to help carry out the final step of the great Professor Turo's glorious research. Okay. So, is this guy... Is Arvin the same Arvin Turo? Is that... Is that just, like, the Professor's last name? But there's something we need we need first. Something that can be found within that lab. What we need is the Violet Book. Okay. Where? You mean this book? Oh, well, you just had it on him? Oh, I guess that makes sense. That's like the thing that had all the all the information on the herbs. Uh, so you took it from the lab, didn't you, Arvin? It's expedite things. Bring the Violet Book to the deepest depths of the Area Zero. I promise that it'll be an exercise worth treasuring if you come. Okay. I love how if he just told us that, that to us from the get-go, Arvin could have just been like, dude, I have it, and we could just go straight there. I must note, however, that Area Zero is both home to vicious Pokemon and outfitted with powerful cybernetic security systems. What? We're gonna get killed by, like, a fucking turret? <laughs> what the fuck is this place? Seems to me that you might struggle if the two of you were to enter alone. Okay. Okay, Professor Turo. Fuck off. I mean, actually, fuck off. Uh, you may take the time to gather some reliable allies before you come, if you feel the need. I will be awaiting you. I'll be awaiting you in the deepest part of Area Zero whenever you arrive. What other allies could we get? Is it just like if I finish the other stuff, I could bring more people? Area Zero. 
That place is bad news. It was down in Area Zero that Ma Mbossif got wounded in the first place. Down in that great crater of Paldea. Okay, so you don't have to ever go, Arvin. In all honesty, I'd be perfectly happy never to see that place again. I'm not asking you to come, mate. You don't need to be here. I mean, I have to. I have to. Because I have to complete all the quests. But you don't have to. Just give me the book, and then you don't have to deal with anything. I suppose he did ask. Yes. You don't have to go, though. <laughs> and I can't just stand and watch while a friend heads off into danger on his own. Okay. Dude, if my boss have dies because of this, I can never forgive this game. So I guess I'm going to. Size. I love to give Dad a piece of my mind. Yeah. I guess that's fair enough. All right, then. What's right outside? We're going to have... Have a Pokemon battle to see if we're really ready to head into Area Zero. Uh, mostly to see if I'm ready or not. Let's go. Well, that's funny. Okay. Well, I'm going to own him again. I'm still so caught up on the whole part of, uh, like, finding other allies. Like, it seemed like, well, like, if we do the whole Team Star thing, we could bring Team Star with us. I don't I don't get it. But maybe that's just, like, a, a, a throwaway line that really just means nothing. Okay, come here. Uh, let's just save real quick before our game dies. Um, also, let's just like put Flamenco first and let him try to get some action. Yep, I'm all ready. Sorry to have to like murder Mabostiff after he just got ready. <laughs> after he feels all good to go. Yes. I'm ready to battle. I feel bad. <laughs> but, uh, seems like he wants to. I, it just seems like a thing that Pokemon like to do is just get hurt. <laughs> Won't leave me alone, always whining at me, wanting to battle you and your Pokemon. It's been so long I nearly forgot, but he always did love to battle. Even if we were lost, always lost to that student council girl, the battle fanatic one. Okay, I guess that makes sense that they would be like rivals, basically, before. They seem to know each other. Anyway, my point is, there's no need to worry. Okay, let's just get it. Let's just get going. We're brand new Arvin and Mabossive, and we're feeling that audacious. Oh, uh, god damn. Let me give you a taste of what we can do. All right, dude, bring it. I'm ready. I mean, I'm sorry I'm going to have to clap you really hard, but I'm ready to own you. I assume that we're hopefully ready. I don't know what typing Braden is, but I feel like he's at least normal type, right? I never used him, so I don't remember. Pokemon that I met during our hunt for the Urban Miska are all stars, every one of them. Uh, well... We're just gonna like double kick your face. Greedom might be a little fat, but I, I don't think it's he's fat enough to warrant a low kick, right? I don't know. Maybe I try it just for shits and giggles. Bitch! Why you have that? Why? <laughs> oh my god, he's level 58! <laughs> oh shit! I was, like, wondering why we didn't really do very well. Uh, do we think low kick's good? I'm gonna fucking try it. Why Why not? Mm, okay, double kick was better. Good to know. Why does he have psychic things? God damn it. Okay. But he is, like, a normal type, at least, I think, so... I think he might be a ground type, so I don't think that you'd be good. I think Clarence might be our best bet. Mm, or Garth. I mean, Garth does have <laughs> the life orb. So it might be doing the most damage. Yeah, Slash probably will do the most damage, I think. I don't really want to terrestrialize. Okay, come on. Oh, baby, that life orb boosted. I don't think he can one shot it. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh, he lived! He lived! Okay, so Greedon is probably part ground type then, which makes sense. I probably should have put out Doc first. Did I just kill myself with Life Orb? I did. Fuck. <laughs> god damn it. Oh, god damn it. I, I didn't think about that. Um, shit, I don't know who he's putting in next. Uh, Nathan probably is the least likely to be doing anything, so I think I'm fine setting him out for Potter, if anything. Cloyster, son of a bitch, I guess wrong. But isn't Rock super effective against Ice? Also, we could do this, right? 
I mean, he might get okay, but this might do... Oh, shit. I forgot that we're so slow. Oh, my God. Nathan tanked that. Okay. I did some damage. Uh, well, now he's taking dot damage, which is fine. I oh, my God. I did so much damage. Okay. Well, so I did 40. I mean, if I attacked again, I would live, but maybe I just... <laughs> Maybe I just hyper potion spam him out <laughs> and let him die at the salt gear. <laughs> I don't know. And see if he does something else. Yeah, because I've been liquidate. I mean, if he crits me, I'm just dead. Oh, he makes our defense go away. I mean, what? That has to hit like two more times? We're definitely too slow to be able to. Uh... Like, there's no universe where Nathan outspeeds him. So I think this is the most effective Nathan can be right now, is if he can manage to live through all Cloyster stuff, and hope, or live through long enough to have Cloyster die to dot. Oh, he got the crit. It's gotta be a crit, right? Or was that just... I guess that was just a defense lowering. Does anyone here have... Okay, well you do have that. I think Clarence is the best to just tank this, right? Because he'll... I mean, not that you can take a lot of damage, but our Ice Shard might do more damage. Might be able to go do enough damage to... Okay, no. No, that was just wishful thinking. I think it's like quad resisted. <laughs> okay. Clarence is a little chunky now. He's taking it. Dude, Salt Gear... <laughs> Salt Gear did work. That, like, actually helped quite a lot. Because I don't think anyone else... I mean, like, Doc might have been able to deal with it, but I don't know. Scovillain. So he's, like, fire grass, right? So either way, Clarence is going to be bad news for that. Uh, so I guess we have to go Dexter. I guess Dexter's, like, our best bet here. Damn. We're going to get owned. Buck. I love how I was talking so much shit, but we're kind of getting rocked. <laughs> railed right now. Fuck me, dude. Okay. So all these are just effective. Maybe I just try to terrestrialize and see if I can, like, boost, like, get enough, um, like, raise our attack enough to be able to do, like, one-shot something. <laughs> God, I didn't know that I used such a high level. I guess this is, like, a good way for them to kind of, like, gatekeep going to like that quest line i guess so maybe if we lose this we'll probably go and like do more you have crunch mate why do you have crunch also why wasn't that super effective it's weird or does this make us pure fire type okay well, let's just do this again is fire that's gonna miss <laughs> I don't know how I knew that, but or maybe I just willed it into existence. I don't know. Who can really say? Wow, this is this fight's taking a bit longer than I expected. It's a bit longer of an episode, but I, I guess it's fine. Okay, Dexter Garganackle. Fuck. Um, that's bad. I guess we're gonna have to go into Doc. Unfortunately. Getting rid of uh, Dexter's like uh, buffs there, but I think that if we get if we put Dexter in for even a round, uh, get like a Shadow Ball off, it's just not going to be worth it. Uh, so Bullet Seed, and I hope we do. He's level 62. Shit. Oh my God, they only hit twice. Oh, Doc's now. Now's not the time to be him. low rolling, my guy. Oh god, he's, he's stealth rock. Oh fuck. I, I think those. I think it's gonna be super effective against the other two people that we would switch into anyway. Fuck me. Okay. Two. Only twice again? What? Come on, live. Oh my god. Okay, Doc, you gotta hit five times. <laughs> Please. You gotta. You gotta make up for it, dude. Or get like a crit. Three, four, come on, yes, oh my god, he did it, he pulled through, holy shit, 
Okay, fuck me. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Doc. Why you why you have to do this? Why you have to make things so stressful, man? Toad scroll? What the fuck? Is this like the tentacruel evolution? I don't even know what this is. I don't think. I don't think we've encountered this. Oh, this is the tentacruel evolution. I have no idea what typing it is. It might be like poison dark or some shit. Okay, so it's still poison type. Good to know. Um, I guess. Oh, I mean, he's still terrestrialized, so maybe I just keep this going. I doubt he's still water type, right? Oh my god, he took so much damage. I think I'm gonna really bank on hoping that. Why do you have earth power? Is he ground type? Oh shit. I don't know what typing this guy is. Because I'm trying to think. He had a poison move. He does also have earth power. I'm trying to think if I should revive someone. God, that did so much damage. Like, who would I revive? Let me see. Earth power fucks up Garth. I think the only person that they don't fuck up with the moves that we've seen is, is gonna be Flamenco. And even then, I don't even know if Flamenco will do a great job. Oh god. Because I, I think this guy might just be so over level. We might just be so fucked anyway. Oh shit! The stones! Oh my god, there's two. I think we are fucked, honestly. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Why is Arvin so fucking stacked, man? <laughs> what the fuck? Holy crap. Okay, yeah, take your goddamn money, Arvin. Son of a bitch. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I have to come back and beat him. Well, that's gonna do that for this episode, guys. Um, so I guess I can't do that for a little bit. Because I think he was like 62. Um, we're not 62. So maybe we uh, go back. Because let's, let's zoom all the way out. Because we've completed Path of Legends. Maybe we do like... I don't know. Maybe we try to do like Starfall Street. I don't know. Point is, we'll do other stuff next episode. Whether it be the victory, like, gyms or the Team Star. Um, like, basically, we'll finish the rest of stuff and then go back to Arvin. Because we're, like, ten levels away from from getting to him. But I think we made some good progress this session. Um, very interesting. Good to see that the boss is still alive and kicking. It's cool to know. Uh, but for now, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye!